Out of the gun. Here's Prescott. He's going to flip one out here to his running back. And now running right through it. And they'll work this down to the 40-yard line. Tackled there. Another big hitter there. This one good for 18. I might say a nifty play for him there. Yeah, that's the ability to read a defense and utilize players that don't often get picked up in coverage easily. And I'm talking about being able to use the backs out of the backfield. Because I know that when I used to cover, hey, we got a bike. Oh, he just snuck out there and they just got a nice first down there. What do we love to say? Get those backs into space, right? And they were able to do that there. Nice pickup on first down. Jackson. Space to run past the 20. And he's going to get it down to the 14-yard line. That burst good for 20 and a first down. Quite the opening drive march they're on right now. It looks a lot like what we saw in practice prior to the game, doesn't it? You know, because on that last big practice beforehand, you go through your offensive script. You go through your play calling. You go through all the stuff and establish things. And it looks like it's going like clockwork right now for them. And after the good game last play, this time they say, uh-uh, as he's going to be stopped behind the line of scrimmage. That'll wind up going for a loss of four. And that's going to make it second and 14. the intended target and that takes us from second to third down Ben it looked like he had his hands on it for a moment but let, let's face it that was going to be a tough catch all the way because of the presence of the defense right there as he was trying to haul it in yeah nice job to force the incompletion third and long for Prescott and that is caught touchdown Cowboys Michael Gallup from 17 yards out. And the Cowboys take it all the way down the field and score on the opening drive. Extra point right down the middle. And it's now a 7-0 game. The kickoff team on the field now as they will send this one away. This is taken about seven yards deep. And he'll elect not to return this one, so they'll bring it out to the 25 on the touchback. So Bree's going to lead the Saints up here first and 10 at their own 25-yard line. From the gun, it's Bree's. Looking left side and completing it to Thomas. And he's taken down but able to slip across the 35. Right off the bat, it's a first down to start the drive, 12 yards. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. The first carry now, this is Alvin Kamara. And getting this just shy of midfield, they'll spot it at the 49. They pick up 12 on the play there, and they move the chains. Back-to-back -back good plays have them on the move on first down. With Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gauden. It's Saints football to begin quarter number two, and they've got it here with a first down. from the gun. It's Breeze. Out of the backfield. That's complete to Kamara. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. 12 yards on back-to-back -back plays there, and that's another first down. 
So many times you hear today's NFL described as a space game. Get your best players into space with the football in their hands. That's why sometimes you just swing it out to your runner, get him out in the flat, and let him have a chance to make people miss an open field. On first down, Breeze. Catch here, left side, Thomas. And they're able to get this one past the 30 to the 25-yard line. Back-to-back -back nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. Throwing on first down is Breeze. Looking for his running back, and he's got it. Inside the five-yard line. A good pick up there, a 22. A first opportunity upcoming in the red zone for the Saints. They've got a first and goal just inside the five. Again, they'll throw with Breeze. Drops this off to Kamara out of the backfield. Three yards is the gain that time. Second and goal. And forget about the run to set up the pass. They're just coming out throwing. Forget trying to set anything up. They feel like they have the advantage. They feel like they have the matchups, and they're just attacking right now. Yep, going to the air on the opening drive. They'll run it with Kamara. And he is not going to get in as the big bodies stop him at the one. They hold him again, and now all of a sudden, it's third and goal at the one. Breeze now on third and goal. He dropped it. Couldn't hang on in the end zone. So no six points incomplete. Didn't have a receiver open downfield, and as it turned out, couldn't even find his outlet, man, because of the coverage. It's way too tight. Unable to find anyone open. Oh, the keeper, it's Breeze. Trying to wedge his way in there. No signal. I don't think he got there. He did it. They try the sneak, but not enough push. He doesn't get in. And this Cowboy defense comes up with a goal line stand. This is Jackson. And nothing but daylight ahead. He's at the 40. Past the 20. Touchdown, Cowboys. A big play there. Taking it goal line to goal line. 100 yards. And the Cowboys are able to show off their quick strike ability. Point after, right down the middle. And that'll make the score 14 to zip. Out is the kickoff unit as they run up and send this one away. That'll be taken in the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. The Saints offense now, they had it fourth and goal. Rolled the dice, didn't get it. Now they've got to put that behind and try to put together another drive. Yeah, a simple tip of the cap, a nod of the head to the defense. Congratulations, you got us last time. But you didn't hold us the whole time. We got down to position. We were able to be in position to score. Let's go ahead and attack again. Continue to have that kind of confidence. Not worry about the one play that didn't allow them to get into the end zone. And this time they'll be trying to get it into the end zone. We'll see what they do. Caught on the left side by Ginn. And he'll get up to the 43-yard line. And before this second down play, we'll get a whistle, a signal, and a timeout. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this second quarter. On second down, here's Breeze. He's going to wind up and air it out. But that's caught at the 25. So a minute 56 to play in this first half. We're back to Arlington right after this timeout. Breeze now on first down. Flushed out right. Finds his man, Watson, over the middle. And on this one, he'll get to the 15, right at the 15-yard line. 10 yards on the pickup there, and it'll be second down. Seeing that play and understanding just how tough it is to cover tight ends, especially the ones running around the NFL nowadays, 
Makes me glad I didn't make it in that league. I would have had a really difficult time. But now you get to sit up here with me. Yeah, and that's fun, isn't it? And <laughs> what a really nice game right there on first down for them. Brings up a nice second down for them. An incomplete pass on second down leads us to third and inches. Now, Breeze again. And he's got it. Touchdown, Saints. Ted Ginn. A 15-yard touchdown grab. And the Saints are back within a score. Lutz with the extra point. And that'll make our score 14 to 7. Lutz now to kick this one away. This is taken about seven yards deep. And an excellent return there as he's up to the 35, but make it the 40-yard line. At some point, we're going to get it through our heads. Special teams, special teams, special teams. The spark that often wins games. Good starting field position for them here as they come up first and 10. 40 and up to about the 42-yard line. Give them three on first down. It'll set up a second and seven. They stay on the ground, but this time it's Elliott. And he is going to be stopped cold behind the line of scrimmage. It'll go as a loss of a yard, and it'll set up third down. Now we'll get a quick timeout called by New Orleans, number two, as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds to go in the first half. The Saints with an extra defensive back here on third on the field. Could they blitz? From the shotgun, it's Prescott. And that is incomplete. Good coverage that time by Patrick Robinson. And I feel like my man, Old Mo, momentum might be changing jerseys right now. How about what they just got done? They scored a touchdown their last drive. Now here's a three and out. Maybe momentum's getting ready to creep to the other sideline. And this is going to hit the goal line and continue on into the end zone for a touchback. And now the Saints get set to trot out there. And what do you think goes on here in this situation? If you got the football, you're trailing, you're back in your own territory with just a little time. Do you try something? You're thinking about jump-starting your team, right? You just mentioned they're down. They're trying to get back into the game. But you got to figure if something goes wrong, you may have put yourself in a spot where you may not be able to come back in the second half. Managing risk, this is a big decision here. here we go. Again from the 20 after the incompletion, here here's second and 10. Breeze hey. again here on second and 10. And he will go down, a Cowboys sack. And now a timeout called by the Cowboys defense. As the clock will stop with 35 seconds to go in quarter number two. After the sack, they'll come up now third and long. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised to see them run the ball here just to try and get some space. Uh, no run call here. They'll look to throw instead. They'll set up the screen now to Kamara. And now the Cowboys are going to call another timeout as they get it right at the 32nd mark of this first half. Here's Thomas Morstead on now to punt it away on fourth down. Back deep is Tavon Austin. We'll call that a punt of 54 yards. Well struck. And the offense will take over with a new set of downs. So out come the Cowboys now as their offense gets set to take over. And with time quickly fading here in the second quarter, not sure how aggressively, offensively they want to play this. I think we'll find out just how much they trust their guys in this situation if they decide to take a shot. And he'll have it past midfield almost to the 40 before being taken down. A good pick up there, a 22. A first down carry by Elliott. And he'll bring this one inside the 45. And we're going to get a timeout with two seconds remaining in the second quarter. 
So with two ticks left here in the half, on is the field goal unit. He's going to need a little mustard on this one. It'll be a 51-yard attempt. And his kick is absolutely perfect. So two quarters down, two remain. Charles and I return after the break. All right, Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. The kickoff unit is out on the field, and they will send this one away. This is taken about seven yards deep, and no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. Out come the Saints now. They'll go on offense first here to begin the third quarter. They have the ball here for the inaugural drive of the second half. Pretty big deficit, though. We'll see what adjustments were made in that locker room. And I never want to make something more important than it actually is, right? I don't want to create more hype than what is there. But well, this is a do real, that? I'm doing it, though. <laughs> this is a really important drive. And we often talk about teams scripting plays to start a game. A lot of them script to start the second half, too. And they're scripting something that they expect to get them into the end zone and back into this game. We'll see if that script is a good one for them. Line of scrimmage, again, the 25, second and 10. Back to the air on second down. It's Breeze. And oh, look at that. A diving catch. 12 yards there as they keep this drive rolling. It's another first down. Every guy that plays this game has plenty of people around him that are concerned for his health and well-being. He had no regard for his body on that catch <laughs> at all, did he? Middle of the field diving to grab it. No, he didn't. Here we go. Here we go. Breeze now 12 of 16 thus far. It's first and 10. Shotgun now for Breeze. Finds Kamara. And he loses the football a second time. I don't know about you, but I could hear and feel the sigh of relief all the way up here in our booth. That yeah, was palpable. The sideline, the friend there. No doubt about it. Ball goes over the sideline, able to retain possession. No turnover. <laughs> I know his coaches are screaming. Just hang on to the ball, man. Demarcus Lawrence in there to pick up his second sack now of the afternoon. Now Breeze on third down. And Gens got it. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. And they pick up 25 as they convert on third. To throw, it's Breeze. That is caught right at the 10-yard line. Touchdown, New Orleans. Ted Ginn, his second touchdown of the afternoon. And the Saints have cut it back within a score. Lutz good on the extra point. And the lead's down to a field goal at 17-14. Lutz now to kick this one away. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. The Cowboys offense now, they head out for their first possession of the second half. The last time out, they had that long 50-plus yard field goal that they missed. And I'm sure on their sideline, they're thinking to themselves, okay, do we still want to try one if we're in that position again? And I would dare say that the answer would be yes. They're going to have a lot of confidence in their kicker. But just to be on the safe side, I'm sure they told their offensive guys, can we get a little bit closer yeah, get this a little time? Closer. Yeah, well, you know, I'd rather get in the end zone first and foremost. But if all else fails, less of a field goal attempt for him. One play has him up past the 40 already and another first and 10. On first and 10, Prescott drops it underneath Elliott. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. And a nice gain of 21 yards. We always talk about having to read defenses and how complicated that is. Well, this was an excellent read. Read the pressure and got rid of the football before it even got to him for a nice game. And when they're blitzing like that, running back usually a good spot to go with a football? Without a doubt, because he's right in your sight line or he's near you. Eight of three, second down. 
tough first half for him, unable to put up the numbers he's used to producing. But with a guy like him, you and I both know it just takes a couple of explosive touches for him to make an impact on this game and on the stat sheet as well. Again, it's Elliott. And he's got this down almost to the 20 before he's dropped. That one goes for 13 yards, and it moves the sticks. Sometimes it's hard to believe, but there are times this game is about patience, isn't it? Has had the game he expected, but that run there, that may get him going. I was just going to say, maybe that gives him a little juice, because you're right, he struggled, especially in that first half. Yeah, and I know the great ones always think to themselves, just hang in there. I'm just one big carry away from busting this open. That's a good start for him. Back-to-back -back nice gains. That one for 14 yards and another first. this one forward as they stop him right around the one. A nice pickup of six there to get him closer to the end zone, and it'll be second and goal. Smith is the lone man in the backfield here as they get ready for second and goal. Here we go now with Smith. And he'll get in. Touchdown, Cowboys. A great play there. Punching it in from a yard away. And the Cowboys will extend their lead. The extra point splits the uprights, and his guys will take a 10-point lead. Set now to kick this one away, and off it goes. This will be taken to the back of the end zone. Out onto the field comes New Orleans. They did what they had to do to start this third quarter. Went down, got the touchdown to cut the lead, but the matching touchdown a moment ago, and we're right back where we started at halftime. Yeah, you're exactly right, Parker. They had a little bounce in their step after scoring that first touchdown, but the defense gave one up, and that's the problem right now. Can they get better play from their defense while they continue to score on offense? He goes full extension, and he's got it. The first down. I know a retirement ceremony is a rocking chair is often one of the major gifts, but don't give this guy one just yet. He may be plus 30, but my goodness, how about that effort? Yeah, he's not that old. Hey, I'm on the wrong side of 32. You, you, you okay? You feeling all right? <laughs> I'll be all right. Okay, good. I just need some chocolate and a box of tissues. <laughs> Breeze now. Perfect since the second half started. Seven of seven. It's first and ten. Now Breeze. Eluding the pressure right. Trying to get it to Thomas, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Anthony Brown. 